Hi there, I'm Steve Bahari, I'm the Vice Chancellor of Massey University. I'm standing here with a very famous person, Shane Bond. If you, even if you haven't played cricket, you will know exactly who this uh, person is. We're outside the Regent Theatre in Palmerston North, where we're holding three graduation ceremonies today, and Shane's about to walk across the stage, and later on, you'll come to an MBA celebration as well. But I thought I'd start by asking you a question I think probably everyone would like to know from a person like Shane, and that is, what's the state of New Zealand cricket? The whole thing about sledging at the moment seems to be on people's minds, very a lot of conflict in cricket. What's your take on where New Zealand cricket is right now and the state of play? Uh, it's an exciting time. I think we have a World Cup here in you know, 18 months time um, and I think everyone saw how huge the Rugby World Cup um, was and how it brought the country together. So I'm hoping from my point of view and from the New Zealand cricket team's point of view that we can bring the, the country together like that and have similar success as the All Blacks. We have a lot of people who are top sports men and women coming through Massey because of the ability to provide an MBA or a at, at distance kind of education. And one of the things they always talk about is that one day this will come to an end and I want to have a good education. You went into coaching after playing actively, how's that gone? And, and has that led to the MBA or is it something completely different? Uh, probably a mixture of both. I think I wanted to always do coaching once I finished playing cricket but one of my big regrets was not finishing an undergraduate degree no. um, and I kicked myself because as I say the life of a sportsman is short so in the end it was Bruce Ulrich who talked me into to, to having a go with an MBA and I'm glad I did. It's certainly taken me out of my comfort zone but I'm delighted that I finished it now. It's given me a whole range of options beyond coaching. I should mention that Bruce Ehrlich is on the Massey Council and is a uh, big sports administrator, so you got a bit of contact with you through through that role. When you look out 10, 15 years, still in cricket, administrating or moving into something completely different, where do you see yourself going? I'd like to have some involvement in cricket, it's, it's my passion, it's what I love, but um, I think you always need options. I think I've been travelling for sort of 10 to 12 years now and I, and I need to get grounded for my children a little bit, and so the opportunities in cricket for that may be limited, so that's what this NBA has given me, hopefully, is the chance to do something outside of cricket and give me some credibility outside of bowling and cricket ball fast. Well th those are the two things we'd emphasise as a university, if you are a, a senior sports person then you do have to at some point get another career and this is one way to do it and one of the fast track ways of doing it to get yourself positioned properly is the MBA because it's something you can really do in a focused way, it creates a network for you of other people who are involved in business so it's got a lot going for it. So, if that's where you're sitting at the present time, you might want to consider that. Congratulations. Thank you. Enjoy the walking across the stage. I will process. do. Thanks. Go well. Cheers.